Squirps. What's good, Squirps? Hello, everyone. I swear, if you make a face with my Scorpios again, I'm gonna punch you in the head. I didn't make any faces. I'm gonna punch him in the head, y'all. I'm gonna punch him in that motherfucking nose. The only face I'm gonna make is the face that I make when I read these cards. All right. It's the only face I'm gonna make. All right, Scorps. This is my very first shirt that I made. Hold on, let me show y'all. It is horrible, but it's my first one, so I'm gonna wear it till the, till the wheels fall off. I'm gonna wear it to the wheels fall off. I'm gonna wear it to the wheels fall off. Mm. I'm gonna wear it to the wheels mm. fall mm. the fuck mm. off. Mm. <laughs> All right, go ahead. Go ahead, Mr. Robinson. Go. All right, Scorpio, mm. let's see what we hit me for. Mm. I know I need to buy a new hat. My hat is so lopsided. <laughs> I'm gonna buy a new one. I love this hat. Mmm. You have Ghosted, Music, X Lover, and Snake. So, I'm going to surmise from these cards that somebody is going to make an exit strategy out of somebody's, uh, uh, you know, y'all uh, situation, okay? Um, I believe somebody is not being upfront or forthcoming with the way they feel or what they think about y'all two as a couple and uh, all the other stuff and that they are basically, they're, they're trying to work or weasel their way out of what y'all have. Like I was saying, instead of just being upfront and saying, hey, this doesn't work for me, you know what I'm saying? Or, you know, maybe, you know, th we're moving too fast or moving too slow or that this just isn't my cup of tea or whatever, you know what I'm saying? So instead of them just being upfront and honest, they're trying to weasel their way out of it and they're just going to, you know, slowly but surely fade into the background, you know what I'm saying? That's what I feel like is going on right here. Here we doing the um, guy from... Um What's that guy? The one that say I'm no, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> What's the guy? What's the guy? From from Tyler Perry? Yeah, you do with him. No, it's no, no, no. <laughs> he always no. said, you know what I'm saying? No, no, no. What's the next four? <laughs> That's exactly what I'm not doing. See, you have crossroads, spiritual awakening mystery and secret crush so you know what i'm saying this person like i said they're in their mind they're they're they, they got the conflict going on and it's like do i want to be in this do i not want to be in this am, am i you know they they're not fully they got one foot in and one foot out you know what i'm saying they're not fully there emotionally mentally and all the other stuff they don't know what they want to do okay so they, they might be looking, not saying they're actually involved with, but they might be taking like mental notes and like looking at other things right now. You know what I'm saying? They're looking, you know, just keeping, keeping their options open. You know what I'm saying? They're keeping an eye out to see if something else comes along. You know what I'm saying? Because they don't really know what they want to do. They don't know. They're at a crossroads. Spiritually, they they they're 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 in the clouds right now. They don't know what's going on. They don't know what they want. They really don't. What's the next three? We gonna see. No, we about to find out. What's, you know what? Scorpio, I don't think this person can handle you. So they want to look for somebody that is not so intense. Spiritually awake, awoken. In other words, somebody that's a little less Scorpio. I know, damn well. <laughs> Wait a minute, Scorpio that's not, channel. you took that wrong. I'm saying that, like you said, they can't handle one, so they, they need not to be with one because they can't handle being with one. That's what I'm saying. They can't handle being with a Scorpio, so they maybe they need not to be with one. I will not that chair, one. sir. <laughs> I will knock you out that chair. <sighs> Scorpio, you are dealing with someone that really can't take you, like you, 
but can't take you. And here's the thing. This person is going to deal with a heartbreak or they're dealing with a heartbreak because they can't face you and say that they can't take you. They can't. Is this person scared of Scorpio spirit? Of Scorpio's love? What's the next three? We're going to find out. We're gonna Let's look. Three of swords. They're scared of being hurt. To a pentacle. So they're going to find someone that, yep, the tower. This person is going to leave. What was it? Yep, healing, date, and party. I can't make this up. You're dealing with somebody that would rather date someone that isn't so intense. We are some intense motherfuckers when we love. We just are. And there are a certain group that can handle us and there are a certain group that can't. And unfortunately, this person can't. What's at the bottom of the deck? What does that say? Liquid courage. What does the rest say? It says bravely confidence intoxicated and odd behavior. This person can't handle you, Scorpio. They can't. They just can't. Who is this? How will Scorpio know who this is? They offered you up a cup, then broke your heart and took it back. That's how you know. That's how you know. Took it back. Oh, back take. There's the cup. Could be a Leo. Could be a Leo. <laughs> Bag on shame. Whoop. Page of swords. And they sit back and watch you. That's what they doing. Why are they watching? Moon. <laughs> afraid. They're afraid of you being a player. The next three. Of you breaking their heart. Oh, blup, dup, 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 dup. <laughs> Can't make this up. You can't. Show them. Got the player card. They're afraid that you are a player. You're going to break their heart. They can't, it's, a, it's a matter of them not being able to deal with somebody like you. And it's unfortunate because you could have loved this person, right? Could have. Page of Cups. And they like you too. Page of Pentacles. And the Knight. Yep. Took all of it back, Scorpio. And the Six of Swords. Along with the Four of Swords. So now they just sit home and they think about you. What's, what's Brandy's song? Um, that was on the Waiting to Exhale. Sitting up in my room. Back here thinking about you. I'm just a mess. No? Yes. Yes. All of that. With the The tower, yep. I was sitting there thinking about how they messed this up and walked away. Hermit, the star, the seven of wands, and, and the hangman. What what comes up in the hangman, though? Scorpio, you tried to bring this person back alive. Like, for real, you tried to bring this person back. Can you go on my phone and um, pull up Brandy's lyrics? You tried to bring this person back alive um, with this connection. You tried to bring them back into the fold. Unfortunately, they didn't. Yeah, you tried. You started putting a guard up. Because they were taking their sweet ass time trying to give back. Because they didn't pry God in a way. They didn't want to tell you that they were afraid. We would have took their poor little heart yeah. and held it in a cage. They would have did that. And smothered it, fed it, and mm -hmm. took care of it, and made sure nobody else Those things. messed Those. with it. Next three. Mm -hmm. Third party. Romantic feelings and proposal. Uh -huh. So they went after the next person, Scorpio. That's what would this it. person like to say to my Scorps? Better say sorry. <laughs> <laughs> what? I can't. <laughs> you were even supposed to look it up on Google. How about that was play? it. I can't play the song. That's on YouTube. Ew. You know why. 
Seems like ever since <laughs> the first day we met. Yeah. There is no one else I think of more than you. Yeah. Uh, sitting up in my room, back here thinking about you. I must confess, I'm a mess over you. Mm -hmm. They're a mess over you. Big Pray mess. that you'll invest in their happiness. All it takes is just one simple call from you. So they're at home waiting for a call. Spelling things. Could be a Capricorn. Could be a Scorpio. Could be. Messy self. I'm crazy over you. Mm How -hmm. you want me now? Yeah. Tell me where to start. <laughs> what the hell are you reading? I don't know what that was about. <laughs> okay, what would this person like to say to my Scorpios? Can you shuffle the whole deck and ask them what they'd like to say to Scorpios? What would they like what to say to my Scorpios? You heard Huey, what I Huey's said. intoxicated. Mm -hmm. <laughs> High priestess, they want to keep it a mystery. Let's dig more. Queen of Swords, can you take your guard down, Scorpio, please, so I can talk to you. They watch you. They want to give you recognition and attention. There's a cup now, y'all. I'm ready to invest into Scorpio. Ten of Swords. Scorpio's like, it's just over. Four of Pentacles. You're full of it. King of Wands, their ego is getting into them. They see something you're doing. What are you doing, Scorpio? The Emperor. Now they want to show up as the Emperor. Cool. Yep. And the Sun. Now they want to be happy and show up as the Emperor. They've been crying too. Go ahead. You got Ghost, Mystery, and Breakup. Oh, they done broke up with the other person that they ghosted Scorpio with? Mm-hmm. What is Scorpio out here doing in these streets? Confusion. Chaos. You out here being a motherfucking empress? Of course they want the empress. Of course. Who wouldn't want the motherfucking empress? Exactly. You out here being the empress? Chomp. And signing contracts and shit. Mm. And doing it all on things, Scorpio. Exactly. And out there going for the stars, reaching for the stars. You out here being mm. a star. -er. Greedy. You have three of cups, the chariot. You're doing a doggone thing. Mm -hmm. Dang, Scorpio, you out here doing a doggone thing. You out here getting that Empress energy going. Then trust them for really? the Really? Really? <laughs> Get up my nerves. <laughs> no, for real, you are. Knight of Swords, Ace of Swords. They don't want to talk to you because you about to break it on down. Mm. Break it on. Oh, yeah. You like... Get out of my face. Mm -hmm. I'm good. I'm good on you. Learn your lesson. Let's do an all signs. Mm -hmm. Aries all the way to Pisces. Man, I like them anyway. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Who you ain't like anyway, Huey? Whoever that person was. What person, Huey? The person that was doing that to Scorpio. Trust them. I ain't like they face. <laughs> you know how you see somebody, meet somebody, you, just, you don't even like they face. Even if they are beautiful. You know what I'm saying? I still don't like your face. Exactly. They ain't even have to do nothing wrong. I still don't like your motherfucking face. Mm -hmm. you, you still, you beautiful, but I don't like your motherfucking face. Exactly. It's, it's just your energy. There it is. All right. If you're dealing with an Aries, this Aries wants to talk. Ooh, this Aries wants to talk and talk some more. Okay. Yeah, proposal. If you do, well, this Aries wants to propose to you. Mm -hmm. If you're dealing with a Taurus, this Taurus is still thinking about things they don't know what to do. They had a crossroads. Oh my God, that's connecting. <laughs> <laughs> if you're dealing with a Gemini, this Gemini is about to stop it with another person and come towards you. Text messages. Oh, you about to hear from this Gemini. If you're dealing with a cancer, this cancer, I feel like you're about to try to leave this cancer, but this cancer is going to try to stop you from leaving. Secret crush. If you're dealing with a Leo, this Leo spying. 
Unexpectedly. You're going to receive a mix, a mix, a, 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 a mixed bag of unexpected messages. What does it say? Surprise. It's surprise. Unpredictable, shocking, unusual. Oh, you probably didn't notice Leo was spying on you. Yeah, no. If you're dealing with, <coughs> if you're dealing with a Virgo, get the heck up on out of there. Mm, third party. That's why you need to get the heck up on out of there. If you're dealing, <coughs> excuse me. If you're dealing with a Libra, this Libra has a holds a lot of passion for you, but they don't really know how to handle you yet either. On a date. That's why they don't know how to handle you because they don't know you yet. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, you feel like the Scorpio feels like you are their wish. One of you rule more than the other, though. Hey, they play. That's why. If you're dealing with the Sag, this Sag wants to tell, wants to confess to you. Healing. That's why they want to confess because they want to heal it. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, this Capricorn is sweet, taking their sweet ass time because they feel like they need to learn you more. Mask. They're hiding something. If you are dealing with an Aquarius, this Aquarius want to dig you down. Woo! This, this a, <laughs> Anxiety. They're a, little, they're a little nervous, but they still want to go through it. They want to, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. They want to <laughs> taste your neck This bones. Aquarius wants to know what you taste like. Mm-hmm, exactly. They, hold, they, yeah, they secretly like, mm -hmm. <sighs> They can't wait. If you're Anxious. dealing with a Pisces, this Pisces is more a career, more focused on their career than anything else. Divine time. Yep, you gotta give them a little bit more time. All right. Scorpio, your overall message for the three, I mean, for the group. I like it this way. This is cool. I like mm -hmm. it this way. Yeah. Okay. Scorpio, if you feel like you need to put boundaries up against people, go ahead and put those boundaries up. It will protect you in the long run. Oh, Don't wow. jump into a relationship until you feel comfortable enough to jump into a relationship. But I do feel like love is getting ready to come in and somebody is going to see it and want you. Respect my space. Bitch. <laughs> All right. I'm 